Dude, you should totally give this series a try. I mean, really, it's just wicked awesome. I'm, I've already plowed through like three books straight. What's it called? Animorphs. It's about this group of kids turning into animals to fight mind-controlling slugs. Meh, I don't like that weird alien stuff. Why not? It's great! Instead of going to boring school, they get turned into tigers and all big bad aliens. They're all like, rah, 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 rah. And then they pick up lasers. And it's all like, pew, 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 pew. I'm a firing my lasers. Pew, 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 pew. pew. Stop that. <laughs> Just watch, Johnny. One day, I'm gonna be a famous writer. I'll write the coolest novel on the block, and every kid will get my book for free. I'll make us rich, and buy both you and Ma really big houses. How would you get rich if you give away the books for free, you dumbass? Free for the kids. The parents will still have to pay, of course. I love how happy he looks. Uh, yeah, I'm sure the parents will be thrilled to give you the money. Shut up and take my money. What, you're still mad about the other day? Oh, come on, I called first dibs on the train fair and square. What happened to your prize anyway? I gave it away. Wait, John gave his prize away and Joey had a train that they won from what? To a hobo? <laughs> Look, it's not just about that day. You know, Ma always favored you. Hey. That's not true. Remember last Christmas? And last Easter and the time we went fishing? And, okay, okay, you know what? You can have my train if you want. Really? Yep. Aw. I mean, hey, by your reason, each other's give me another one, right? <sighs> Game. <laughs> Listen, Johnny, what difference does it make who owns what? Everything that's mine is yours, too. I mean, we both get to play with it, right? Yeah... Right! I mean, come on, you're my twin brother, dude! You're like a part of me! Oi, let's go confuse the neighbors. Uh... <laughs> wait, wait, in the rain? Yes, in the rain, come on! So receive note, Animorphs. Oh, and there we have it, all five again. Really easy, but let's, oh, looks like Johnny's uh, red up here. We've got red on you. So what do we got now? We got roadkill, what is new? We've got Animorphs, uh, Joey's childhood, fa Joey's favorite childhood book. So you'll notice that Joey, Johnny's twin brother, deceased since childhood. Uh, they, they've been changed, as you can tell, the Joey description has changed from being what John's grand or mother called her, and then the Animorphs, which weren't actually Johnny's favorite book, they were Joey's. It's a little interesting. So let's uh get out of here with the not enough. Wait, not enough memory links established. Wait, is it glitching on me now? Okay, what the? That was weird. It's impossible to not have enough memory links established in this part because obviously we got them there instantly. So here, young childhood, we were children. Children actors. Some kind of carnival, huh? Shall we look around? How about I look around and you just stand here? How about we continue speaking in the form of questions for the next hour? Quit blathering and go already. Ah, you ruined it. <laughs> Alright, so that's very nice. There are a couple things we can do here, actually. Let's go talk to this guy. Fruits! Fresh fruits! Apples, oranges, and tomatoes! We got it all! Wait a minute. Tomatoes aren't fruits. Uh, yeah, they are. They are the ovaries of the plant and contain seeds. That's what a fruit is. But come on, tomatoes! We never ever refer to them as fruits! Wrong voice. We who? I happen to enjoy cooking in groups, okay? Some of us take it very seriously. <laughs> we got this guy. Fruits! Fresh fruits! Did we get a memory for that? But anyway, oh, here's the kids! We got blocked by grass there. But I don't like this stupid toy! I want the train! What? That's the only train left, you little boy. Do you want to change your prize for a teddy bear instead? No, I just want the train. No, no, Johnny, don't make a scene. Joey won a fair and square, didn't he? 
But I won too. You just went first. Hehe, <laughs> it's okay. I'll let you play with it too. See how nice your brother is, Johnny? <laughs> okay, you dumplings. Don't block the stand. <laughs> Come, let's go see what's over there. I'm not a dumpling. Uh oh. You know what? I'm gonna call you dumpling from now on. You're bluffing. <laughs> so here we've got an interesting little thing here. We talked to this guy. Hey, is that a whack a mole? A whack a what? Whack a mole, you take a mallet and whack moles. Isn't that some animal abuse? <laughs> They're fake moles, butthead. That's how people blew off steam before first person shooters were invented. How primitive. Yeah, it's pretty ghetto. <laughs> Where'd you read about it? My grandpa was a fan. <laughs> I want to play. Just hit everything on the head and you win. Yes, 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 yes. Now this one, um, when I played this on my laptop, it was a lot easier for whatever reason. I can't use this mouse because there's a slight delay. But you can use the direction pad, but it's still, I use the mouse is a little bit easier. So we're going to go ahead and select yes. So we're going to use the keyboard. No, use mouse. And it's a little, okay, no, mouse, stop it. Okay, good, it was frozen there. So basically, we're not, we're measured on our accuracy here. So um, you get hit, or um, uh, great on how many you hit and how many times you smack. Uh, come on, come on. Okay, come on. Okay, my thing is off. As you can tell, it's going towards the ceiling. My highest score is 95%, and that was my first time playing on my laptop. This isn't that hard, but of course, you know, playing on a different computer and then doing this really dumb. Okay, there. We're doing a bit better. And my, my thing is going off screen. I hope I don't accidentally open up an ABI file from the thing, because like I said, this is like outputting in 640 or 320 or something, so the screen's really small. Time's up! Great. So we got, let's see now. At a 46 total target, you struck 65 times and made 46. Oh, very nice. That is not too bad. That's an 86. That was bad. It's your new record. Uh, so I think you can't play that over and over again. It's kind of a waste of time. It's just a little slight little diversion there. Wait a second. Uh, do we have... All right, come on, game. Stop freezing up on me. Okay, are you not going to show the... Never mind, whatever. Let's get out of here. All right, so if we head down here, we got kind of an interesting little scene. Some guy looks very happy down here. Let's see what he's got to say. Oh, welcome and behold, the world's so marvelous of first will. Can we ride it? Absolutely not. Does it even work? Absolutely not. <laughs> Looks like someone just glued some chairs to a water wheel. <laughs> don't know, don't care. Oh, and something I should probably mention right there is the fact that we're still, visibility is still off and we were able to play whack-a-mole, so let's talk over here and see what we got over here. Oh yes, a fortune of a wonder on ahead of you. This one might have just become a lawyer, and this one a doctor. Oh my! Come on, I'm getting both of your treats. Why, wow, you actually believe that? <coughs> hey, a where's on my tip? Uh, okay. I guess, I'm um, okay. <laughs> so anyway, let's head over here. She's gonna get their kids a treat. Oh, how, what a nice mom. When I become a father, if I become a father or whatever, I'm gonna spoil my kids so badly, like whatever they want. But I'm not gonna let them become pretentious little things. I'm gonna discipline them, you know, and everything will be A-OK. -okay. But if we head up here, there's a choir of us singing. We must blend into a choir, sing a static with the whole. We must memorize nine numbers and deny we have a soul. And into the endless race of property and privilege to be one. We must run, we must run, we must run. I can never understand you, Joey. How can you stand the taste of them? They're just so sour and icky. Sour and awesome is what you mean. Oh, just try it. Nah, I don't even want to taste the regular olives. You should try at least one, Johnny. Who knows, maybe you'll like it. Yeah. Uh, wait a minute. <laughs> I'm done, though. Can I go play? Okay, but only at the playground and not an inch too far. Yay! Just leave that back. I'll keep it for you. No, it's mine. I want it. Aw, you guys. So, pickled olives. We can take a look at the description for that, which happens to be... Uh, this one also changed. Johnny's favorite. No longer, as you can tell, John was not exactly a fan. He liked it just as much as we did. Let's head on over here. We've got all the things. So let's go see what Johnny's off to <laughs> doing. Hmm. So... There he is, and there's like stationary, what are those things called? Those like carousel horses? Huh. So. Looks like this place is pretty crowded. Why would you go play at a playground during a carnival? Wait, where are you go- Johnny, what are you doing? Oh, doll, you little kid. What? 
Way to follow mom's orders, huh? Alright. So, let's go do that. Now, since it's been a while since we've saved, we're actually... I wouldn't say we're closing in on the end, but I'm going to save really fast, just because. So. Let's go and save, because it's been a while since we've saved. I'm sorry. Horse. We're going to have to go over you. Alright. Now that that's all said and done, let's head on up. Let's head on over to the next place in the game. So, what are you doing, Johnny? Oh, what the? Wait, did he see something he didn't like? What is it, boy? Is the dog stuck in the well? He survived somehow? He's drowning? He's a dachshund? He's a cocker spaniel? So, what are you doing? Oh. Wow. Jumped over the creek and... Wait, this place looks a little familiar. Wow. This is probably one of the best scenes in the game, I think. It's... It reminds me so much of when I was a little kid. Like, there's a story I have to tell you guys, like, so badly. Like, when I get a chance, when there's... Uh, so I'm not now. Now is not the time nor the place. Like, 15, not even 15. Like, 14, 13 years ago or something. Whoa. So the story just, uh... Scene just touches my heart and strokes it in a very familiar and good way. Well, okay. So he wandered off the trail and found a cool place. But let's face it, he could have also been eaten by a pack of tigers. <laughs> tigers don't track in packs, idiot. It's just an expression. You know, when I was a kid, my grandpa took me stargazing every year. Yeah? There was a hill outside of the city that we'd stay at. The same one every year. We'd watch the stars till daybreak. Well, I did, mostly. You just carried the telescope for me. Of course. The thing was, though, Ma didn't want me to stay up late. Grandpa always told her that we were just camping and hid the telescope inside the car. That's all good, but when we got back in the morning, I had to pretend like I'd actually slept. <laughs> so, in conclusion, that's the story of how I started my caffeine addiction. <laughs> Very good story. <laughs> You're terrible. I know. <laughs> It's a shame, though. All these nice memories, lost and never found. And who knows how many more like it? Well, as you say, just take a moment for a moment, right? Mm-hmm. Oh, shit! I told you a pack of tigers dwell here! Wait.